Good morning, everyone. Today is the 11th of January, 2022. It's Tuesday morning. And when, when Scripture tells us that there is only one mediator between God and man, and that is the man Christ Jesus, it's pretty exclusive, is it not? There are many religions in the world, Buddhism, Confucianism, um, Baha'i faith, um, Roman Catholicism, Mormonism, um, Hinduism, uh, a lot of isms out there. Christianity is a very exclusive religion. You know, and it has a very uh, exclusive leader, and that exclusive leader is the eternal Son of God, Jesus Christ, and there is only one mediator between God and man, and that is the man Christ Jesus. It's not Buddha, it's not Allah. It's not transcendental meditation or yoga. It's the precious blood of Jesus Christ that cleanses us from all sin. Jesus Christ said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh to the Father but by me. To us, there is but one God, the Father, of whom are all things, and we in him, and one Lord Jesus Christ, in whom all are things, are all things, and we by him. All men should honor the Son, even as they honor the Father. He that honoreth not the Son, honoreth not the Father which has sent him. By him, therefore, let us offer the sacrifice of praise to God continually, that is, the fruit of our lips, giving thanks to his name. I beheld on a great multitude which no man could number of all nations and kindreds and peoples and tongues stood before the throne and before the Lamb clothed with white robes and palms in their hands and cried with a loud voice saying salvation to our God which sitteth upon the throne and unto the Lamb. Amen. Blessing and glory and wisdom and thanksgiving and honor and power and might be unto God, our God, forever and ever. Amen. Revelation 9, um, Revelation 7, 9, 10, and 12. The Lord of hosts is his name. I will ransom thee from the power of the grave. I will redeem them from death. O death, I will be thy, thy plague. O grave, I will be thy destruction. He that believeth on the Son hath everlasting life, and he that believeth not the Son shall not see life, but the wrath of God abideth on him. You're dead, and your life is hid with Christ in God. When Christ, who is our life, shall appear, then shall ye all... Then shall ye also appear with him in glory, when he shall come to be glorified in his saints, and to be admired in all them that believe. John 3, Colossians 3, 3 and 4, and 2 Thessalonians 1, 10. To the only wise God our Savior. So... When Christ proclaimed that I am the way, the truth, and the life, no man cometh to the Father but by me, he was proclaiming a very exclusive religion. And it wasn't just a religion, it was the truth. It was the, the way. It was the life. When he said, I am the way. I am the truth. I am the life. When we are told 
that he, there's only one mediator between God and man, that is the man Christ Jesus. That, that totally eliminates any other way to God other than Christ. So when people pro- pro- proclaim all paths lead to God, and God is the is the center and all like a wagon wheel and all spokes lead to the center and all spokes of all the different religions. This is a lie. This is a lie from Satan. This is to get people's minds off of Christ. And so this morning, <clears throat> let us <clears throat> praise and exalt Jesus Christ. You know, let us never forget that he is the King of kings and Lord of lords. Let us never forget that on Christ the solid rock we we stand. All other ground is sinking sand. His oath, his covenant, his blood supports me in the whelming flood. When all around my soul gives sway, he then is all my hope and stay. On Christ's solid rock I stand, all other ground is sinking sand. And uh, so let us never forget Jesus Christ is the King of kings and the Lord of lords. And we must never forget <clears throat> that he is the almighty king. I hope it's built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest thing, but wholly lean on Jesus' name. On Christ's solid rock I stand, all other ground is sinking sand. All other ground is sinking sand. Darkness seems to hide its face. I rest on his unchanging grace. In every high and stormy gale, my anchor holds within the veil. On Christ the solid rock I stand, all other ground is sinking sand.